What's going on, Freedom Family? Today's video, I have with me... I'm Liam. i Eli. We have Liam and Eli here, and we're going to talk to you about Freedom Kids, but more specifically, our channel, Twin Toys. <laughs> Link will be in the description below if you want to see our crazy toy videos and candy reviews, and also, you know, join our journey as we go from a complete nobody channel to trying to find our way through uh, YouTube. Before we go into our experience, let's first dive into the stats of kid or toy review channels. If you look on Social Blade, you'll see in the top five channels in the last 30 days sorted based off of views, you'll see two out of the five are actually kid or toy review channels. The first one is Toy Funds Collector, who generates roughly 500 million views a month. And the funny thing is, if you actually go to her channel, the videos are easy to make. There's barely any editing at all, she doesn't even show her face. She shows her hands opening up cute toys, both for the girls and the guys, and it's just infectious to sit there and watch her. She generates so many views, it's unfathomable. The funny thing is, is her channel is, actually generates more views in the last 30 days than Taylor Swift's channel. That is unbelievable. The most trendy types of views in the kids' community on YouTube are ones to such of like Kinder Easter egg openings, just cute toy reviews, challenges. As you can see, we're not talking several million, we're talking several hundred million views. That's crazy. I know you guys are wondering why again are we talking about Freedom Kids, but let's be honest here. What better way to provide proof than to take it from the horse's mouth? So we decided to start our own channel and it's called Twin Toys. In which we ourselves unbox toys, review candies, do some challenges, uh, Kinder Eggs, we're still working on that considering we live in the U.S. and we don't know about that one. It's actually banned for possession here in the United States due to a choking hazard by the FDA. So firstly, we tried Warhead Challenge. It was trendy on YouTube and so we're like, you know what, let's see what happens when we put the kids involved. Guess what happens? What? Instantly, 10 radio stations put our video on their Facebook pages and on their websites and our views grew immensely. We only had 25 subs at the time and the video generated about 3,500 to 8,000 views. After that, people started coming in realizing that they find us infectious on candy reviews. So we started to continue with the Warhead series, doing other different types like freezer pops, and jelly beans, and the super sour double drops. And currently today, we're over 600 subs and generate 1,000 views per day, and our channel is only two months old. So, to be honest, it's one thing listening to George talking about Freedom Kids, it's another thing putting it into perspective and doing a case study and see how in the world it actually works and does it actually work. Coming from the horse's mouth, I definitely approve that kid channels are infectious, there's a humongous audience out there for it, and if you're a parent and have kids, definitely do a YouTube channel on there. Now guys, I know you're saying the kids are not of legal age for terms of service to actually run a channel. We're not talking about owning, possessing a channel. We're talking about the parents owning the channel and then they videotape their kids doing whatever, opening toys, doing candy reviews, whatever. That is allowed. And guys, to be honest, anybody of any age can sit there, go out and buy some Kinder Easter eggs, put your hands on the camera set and open up all these chocolate eggs for 20 minutes and watch as your views just soar. It's unbelievable. So guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you learned a lot and a little bit more about the kids community out there on YouTube. Our again, our channel is Twin Toys. Link will be in the description below if you want to watch some crazy footage of them doing the Warhead Challenge and doing a Baby Food Challenge and opening some crazy Lego sets and some Play-Doh sets. And also make sure you check out Freedom Kids into which we're going to keep uploading more kids videos and channels over there. As well as tutorials into how you can grow your kids channels fast. And also what to look out for when it comes to trendy videos. Once again, I'm Aaron, Head of Marketing for Freedom. I'm Nam. I-E-I. -I. Thanks for watching. Bye. Secrets. If you really look at yourself, you will be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, kids more worried about.